Are you looking to create a brand guide for influencers, for news media, or for any other reason? Well, there's a deal that's going on that's called the Baseline. And in this video, it's going to be a review so I can tell you what I like and dislike about it. Now, first of all, it's super easy to use and there's a lifetime deal going on right now. But second of all, I have to be clear, this is something that you can potentially build on a website. It's just going to take you longer and a bit more of steps. This is a good idea if you plan to use something simple or use this to resell it to other clients. So let me talk about the deal that's going on right now. It's $69 for the lifetime deal and you get access to five brands. So that means you can do five brands and five brand guides. Unlimited designs because it includes a type of a canvas system where you can design some images. It's not the best tool and it's not the main focus of this tool. It just includes it. So I wouldn't focus on that. Now, License tier two, I wouldn't recommend that. And if you plan to do this, if you have a whole bunch of brands and if you plan to do this as a business, take for example, if you're going to offer this service on Fiverr, on whatever for your clients, if you have a marketing agency, then this could be a good system. For unlimited brands, $209. Now, let's go jump over to Baseline just to show you how easy it actually is. So first of all, you have the option for designs, which I don't want to focus on that. I'll show you that on the end. First, let's go into the brands, which is where you're going to create your brand guide. Let's name this, I'll just say new for this. Obviously, you would put your own um, brand name. And I'll, this one, I'll put yes, we have a logo. And this is where you have to upload the SVG logo. If you don't have an SVG logo and you have a PNG logo, I recommend just searching on Google for something that turns PNGs into SVGs. Don't worry too much about that. Logo water, logo mark, we don't have one, so I'll just put my logo and you have the option to upload your white logo. Now in this case, what I've uploaded right now works also on black background, but if not, I'll delete it and add a white logo. I'll keep it as it is, go to next, and now it's going to ask me for my palette of colors that I use. For example, I've select, you know what, I use blue, and this is kind of the shade of blue. You can use the hex or the RGB. That's one I will use. Go ahead and use that. I'll add another color and I'll keep it as it is. You add your colors as needed because these colors are going to be a guide for your influencers, your media and all of that where they can grab these hex codes to use on their own. Let's use these colors and now I can use gradients that I think are fitted for my brand. So I can say, you know what, I'll provide them this gradient, this one also and this one and this one. Okay, they're okay to use these gradients because I like these and they fit my brand. So I'll say confirm gradients. There we go. Select the font that you're going to use or allow your influencers to use. Select them and go to next. The type scale, again, all that information, base size, race scale ratio, preview text, etc. Go next. And here we go. We have created a brand guide just like that. Obviously, there's more options and I'll show you those in a bit. So these are the way that you can view the logo. We can go ahead and download it. Okay. The safe zone. So we're letting um, media by media users know where the brand logo is like if, if it has a little r on the top right what well, we're telling them hey go ahead and use the r because that's where the logo is or the safe zone okay and just like that we just build the brand guide and so just like that we have our own brand guide right now now in this page we're letting them know what the logo is how to download it copy to clipboard let them know how it's going to look on the black background the safe zone for the logo so they need to know where it starts and ends okay the prohibited use of the logo so you can't rotate it you can't skew warp it you can't change the colors you can't add filters etc um, something that's missing on baseline is a way to disable one of these because i might allow saying you know what you can rotate the logo so you might want to have options to remove or add that. They don't have it now, but it would be something that they would, it would be nice if they add. The colors that we, we're letting our media know that these are the ones that it's okay to use. Here's the colors that they can grab and use it. The gradients that I'm allowing, etc. The fonts that I'm allowing, the type, type typography scale, etc. And here we go. We have the baseline logo on the bottom, but if you have this plan, the lifetime deal plan that's at a limited time. You can remove that just by clicking on the share. We can go ahead and remove the URL. Now you're getting this error, which also I think that's something that they should work on. But if you edit this logo, this brand link to something like that, I think it's used already, is it? Here we go. Now that works. So now I can use this link without the logo. I can go in cognito mode and someone with that link can actually view the brand guide and they know what's going to go on. They know what they have to use and how to use it. 
now there's more to this now right now they don't have custom domain so that means that if you share a link well it has baseline in it but there's a workaround for that just use the embed so in the embed you add that to your website and obviously you're sharing the link to your website let's go back to this and we can add a tone of voice so this brand that we've just created i can add a tone of voice so for example if you're talking if your brand is about something um, serious well you let them know that if you're going to do something that has to be serious or funny or neutral so in this case we'll just say serious the formality and i'll just go through these really quickly because it's letting the media know what we are allowing or not let's go ahead and save this tone of voice if we scroll down through our brand guide we're going to view it here we go tone of voice here it is. Now we're letting them know how they should be speaking, talking, writing, etc. with the tone of voice. So it's super easy to do that. And that's a brand guide. I mean, that's how easy it is. If you are doing this as a business, well, creating several of these is going to be, is going to be a breeze. The next thing they have is the designer. So for example, if I want to create a Facebook post, it's this right here. Like I mentioned before, I don't think this is the main um, purpose of this tool, but they have it included. So if I like this, and I want to create something for my brand. It already, it's already adding my logo and something like this. And I have the brand. I got elements, photos, uploads, templates, and settings that I can work with the, this designer. We have the settings on the right for each one of the elements that we've select. But it's pretty cool that we have this, especially if we don't have an image designer already that we're using as an alternative. So this is a good option. We go ahead and download these designs and we're good to go. So right now it's exporting and we're able to select the design. Here we go, it's exporting, download, and use it for your social media. So they have several templates available that we can use, and they got a stock library included that we can use also, and all of that for this lifetime deal price. So at the end of the day, I think that if you don't have a lot of brands and you don't mind paying $69, you're good to go. And if you don't have a lot of brands and you can build this on your own on a website, then you can skip this and don't pay for that. And if you have a bunch of brands or if you want to do this do this as a business, like offer the service to your clients on Fiverr, on Freelancer, etc., then it's a good idea to have something that you can build super easy and fast and it's unlimited. So those are the options that you have right now. And that's a wrap for this deal that's going on.